by secretly flirting while sailing along the French shore. Yes, we sail all along the French shore. This couple has children now married, I ween. You see, they're not young anymore. Nor yet do they know that I witnessed the show that they staged all along the French shore. Yes, while sailing along the French shore. So this ends the story of those bonny days Oh, that I could live them once more With what I now know I'd produce my own show And I'd stage it along the French shore Yes, I'd stage it along the French shore As I was sitting in my own cozy corner Thinking all on a few dollars to make My wife says to me, why don't you try sobbing They're making good wages up on the Twin Lakes The answer I gave, I don't know what about it For I don't want the A&D company to break I'm afraid they won't find enough money to pay me If I get some on sobbing up on the Twin Lakes I started for Twin Lakes late up in November Thoughts of the subbing would make your heart ache I got home some firewood, packed me old kit bag And started right off for the shores of Twin Lakes I arrived at the camp one fine Sunday evening About four o'clock if I make no mistake The bunks were all filled so I slept on the table That's how I spent my first night up on Twin Lakes some men in their sleep, they were piling up timber Others were shouting, pass down the shortcake And all kinds of nonsense, I cannot remember The boys they were using up on the Twin Lakes It's up in the morning in a very good humor Out in the four peak a box saw to take A chance of good timber, I heard in the rumor It could not be found on the shores of Twin Lakes it's out in the woods with a box saw and measure Work like a slave, small wages to make If you want any money, you'll have to quit subbing You'll get no more show on the shores of Twin Lakes Two dollars they'll pay you for piling up timber Then eighteen dollars for board they will take And then they will charge you six dollars for blankets And that's how you're soaked on the shores of Twin Lakes Look at those contractors, see how they will nip you They'll keep you right down with their foot on your neck If you want a good show and plenty of timber Try and keep clear of the shores of Twin Lakes Come all you young women seeking a husband Don't marry a supper, don't make that mistake If you want a good home and plenty of money Don't marry the supper subs on the Twin Lakes Come all you old merchants who stand round your counter Waiting a poor supper's money to take And when you sit down to your fresh pork and cabbage Just think on the supper, subs on the Twin Lakes Come all you young men who are seeking employment Heed a poor supper's warning and make no mistake Get aboard the express and go across the island And try and keep clear of the shores of Twin Lakes
Of a trick that was played on me, it won't delay you long. I came from sea the other day, a fair girl I didn't meet. She kindly asked me to a dance, it was up on Peter Street. I said, Oh no, my fair maid, though I can dance quite well. Tonight I'm bound for Wigelow's town, that's where my people dwell. You'd better come with me, she said, the distance is not far. And finding her so friendly, I jumped into her car. 
Just as the dance was over, straight to the bed did go. It was little did I ever think she'd pull my overthrow. Rob my go watching 30 pounds of pack of eggs and fled. And left me here stark naked alone upon the bed. Now when I awoke in the morning, it was nothing could I spy But a woman's shirt and apron all on the bed did lie I wrung my hands, I tore my hair, I cried, what shall I do? Farewell, I'm bound for Wigelow's town, no more will I see you Just as the streets were lonesome at the hour of two o'clock I put on the shirt and apron and marched down to the dock When the crew they saw me coming, these words to me did say My dear old chap, you've struck a snap since you've been gone away Is that the new spring fashions that the ladies wear on shore? Where is the shop you bought them at and is there any more? The captain on the quarter deck looked at me with a frown Saying, Jack, I'd buy a better suit than that for 30 pounds Well, I would, sir, if I could, sir, and I only got the chance But I met the girl on Peter Street and she asked me to a dance She danced my old destruction, I got robbed from head to feet But I'll take my oath no more, I'll go to a dance on Peter Street Ye landsmen and ye seamen, a warning take by me Be sure and choose good company when you go out on spree Be sure and choose good company or you find yourself like me With a woman's shirt and apron for to fit you out for sea Woo! <laughs> Thank you. 
one class of men in this country that seldom is mentioned in song. And now that their trade is advancing, they'll come out on top before long. They say that our sailors have danger, and likewise our warriors bold. But there's none knows the life of a driver, what he suffers with hardship and cold. With their peck poles and peavies and battles and all, and the shore to drive out in the spring, that's the time. With the cocks in their boots as they get on the logs, it's hard to get over their time. Billy Dorothy, he is the manager, and he's a good man at his trade. And when he's around seeking drivers, He's like a train going down grade But still he's a man that's kind-hearted On his word you can always depend And there's never a man that goes with him But likes to work with him again With his peck pole and peavies and battles and all And the shore to drive out in the spring, that's the time with the cops in their boots as they get on the logs It's hard to get over their time The drive it is just below Badger And everything is looking grand With a jolly good crew of pit fellows And Ronald Kelly in command For Ronald is boss on the river and I'll tell you, he's a man that's alive. He drove the wood off Victoria, now he's out on the main river drive. With his peck pole and peavies and battles and all, and the shore to dry out in the spring, that's the time. With the cocks in their boots as they get on the logs, it's hard to get over their time. I'll tell you today, home in London, the times they are read by each man. But it's little they read of the fellows who drove the wood off Mary Ann. For paper is made out of pulp wood, and many more things you may know. And long may they live for to drive her up on pay me off and Tom Joe. With their peck poles and peavies and battles and all, and the shore to drive out in the spring, that's the time. With the cocks in their boots as they get on the logs, it's hard to get over their time. And now to conclude and to finish, I know that you all will agree In wishing success to all Badger And the A and D Company And long may they live for to flourish To continue to chop, drive and roll And long may the business be managed By Mr. Dorothy and Mr. Cole with their peck poles and peavies and battles and all And the shore to drive out in the spring, that's the time With the cocks in their boots as they get on the logs It's hard to get over their time Yes, it's hard to get over their time
From Twilling Gate Isle I've been the world over North, South, East and West But the middle of nowhere's Where I like it best Where it's wave over wave Sea over bow I'm as happy a man As the sea will allow There's no other life For a sailor like me But to sail the salt sea boys Sail the sea There's no other life But to sail the salt sea The work it is hard And the hours are long My spirit is willing My back it is strong And when our work's over Then whiskey we'll pour We'll dance with the girls Up on some foreign shore Where it's wave over wave Sea over bow, I'm as happy a man as the sea will allow. There's no other life for a sailor like me, but to sail the salt sea, boys, sail the sea. There's no other life but to sail the salt sea. I'd leave my wife lonely ten months of the year She made me a home and raised my children dear But she'd never come out to bid farewell to me Or can why a sailor must sail the salt sea Where it's wave over wave Sea over bow I'm as happy a man as the sea will allow There's no other life for a sailor like me But to sail the salt sea, boys, sail the sea There's no other life but to sail the salt sea I've sailed the wide ocean for decades or more And many times wondered what I do it for I don't know the answer pleasure and pain with life to live over i'd do it again where it's wave over wave sea over bow i'm as happy a man as the sea will allow there's no other life for a sailor like me but to sail the salt sea boys sail the sea there's no other life but to sail the salt sea Well, I can't complain. I haven't had it as hard as some, God knows. And for the bit of time that you've been around in the past 16 years, well, you've been a good man. I remember the year we married. It was a good year. You were working for my father. And it seems to me that I had you all to myself every minute of every day. And all the sweet, long hours of the night. I think that was the happiest year of my life. But by the spring of the following year, uh, just after my birthday it was, 
Well, you got to be itching after something. And in no time at all, you'd gone down and you'd signed up on the Mary Eleanor. It was then I knew I was married to a sailor. I couldn't even bring myself to go down and say goodbye to you. Now, I'm not complaining. We've always had a roof over our heads, and we've never wanted for very much. I always said now that I never had it as hard as May. Her husband, Jack, well, he'd only be home one or two days out of every year. That's when he was working on the coastal boats. My dear, when he'd come home on the Prospero, she'd have to go down there and get him because he was too blind drunk to make his way home by himself. And I'll never forget the night I was over at Nan's. The night Poppy Rogers came home. Poppy Rogers, gone 11 years. We hadn't heard a word from him. We didn't know what had happened to him. Sure, we'd give him up for dead. Well, that night, Nan just looked out of the window and she saw him coming up the path. And all she said was, put the kettle on, Frank's home. But I do wish you'd been here with me when Gary died. My God, that was a hard winter. The flu, epidemic proportions, they said on the radio. I remember the night Mom and I laid him out. Oh, your mother came over too. I think Gary was her favorite, really. Anyway, that night I sought up with him. I sought up in that big old chair your brother made. And I must have dozed off, because around four or five o'clock in the morning, I woke up. And just for an instant, you were there. You were bending over and kissing his cheek. Well, you were back in port six months later, and you gave me Kevin. And Kevin had the croup. He coughed and he bawled for a solid year straight. He had me raftered. He had me clear, drove off me head. And then the following year, well, you were only home for a week. I got Rose out of that visit. But you've always sent me lovely presents. Sometimes a year goes by and I have no word, no letters or such, but always bits and pieces from here, there and everywhere. A lovely shawl arrived for me in the mail today. Three yards of beautiful colored silk. I wonder where it's from. Spain? Morocco? Some place I've never been to. Oh, it's gorgeous. And the smell of it. It puts me in mind of warm winds and people speaking in foreign tongues. But sure, where am I going to wear it? I suppose now I'll put it on when I go out in the garden digging up a few turnips or when I'm making a bit of soap out of lye. Well, I'll go and light the candle for you now. It'll always be here in the window to guide you home. I'll always be here for you, God willing. You know, when all is said and done, for the bit of time that you've been around in our married life, well, you're the only man I've ever had. You're the only man I ever wanted. Where it's wave over wave, sea over bow, I'm as happy a man as the sea will allow. There's no other life for a sailor like me, but to sail the salt sea, boys, sail the sea. There's no other life but to sail the salt sea. Thank you. 